Have you ever wondered about the history of backgammon? Well, let's start with what it is. Backgammon is one of the oldest known board games, a tantalizing mix of strategy and luck. Two players compete, each with 15 checkers, moving them according to the roll of two dice. The objective? Simple. Be the first to bear off or remove all your checkers from the board. Now, you might be wondering, but where did backgammon originate from? Let's dive into its fascinating history. The origins of backgammon trace back to ancient times, over 5,000 years ago. The cradle of this intriguing game lies in the fertile crescent of Mesopotamia, what we now know as modern-day Iraq. This region, renowned for its significant role in the development of early civilization, also birthed the game that would transcend time and borders. Back then, the game was played on board surfaces carved out of wood, a testament to the craftsmanship of the era. The playing pieces, fashioned from stones, were moved across the board in strategic maneuvers, a nod to the game's enduring appeal. But the story of backgammon doesn't stop at the boundaries of Mesopotamia. This ancient game, steeped in strategy and chance, found its way along trade routes and across vast oceans. It was embraced by different cultures, each adding its unique twist to the game. This ancient game was not confined to Mesopotamia, it spread to many parts of the world. From the ancient world, backgammon traveled through time, evolving and adapting to different cultures. Its journey is a testament to its enduring appeal and adaptability. Its next major stop was in the heart of the mighty Roman Empire, where it was known as tabula, Latin for board. The Romans were famously fond of games and leisure, and backgammon fit right into their lifestyle. From soldiers to senators, many enjoyed this strategic game. Roman tabula, while similar to its Mesopotamian predecessor, had its own unique rules and gameplay, further evolving the game and setting the stage for the backgammon we know today. As the Roman Empire fell, backgammon continued its journey, finding its way into the Middle Ages. It was especially popular among the aristocracy, who often played it in their grand halls. Kings and queens, knights and nobles, all found pleasure in its strategic depth. It was during this time that the game took on its modern English name, backgammon. However, it wasn't all smooth sailing. In the mid-16th century, backgammon faced a major setback in England. It was prohibited by the authorities who deemed it a distraction from archery practice, yet the game's appeal was too strong. It was not long before it made its comeback, winning over the hearts of the English once again. The game continued to evolve over the centuries, but perhaps the most significant change came in the 20th century with the introduction of the doubling cube. This added an entirely new strategic layer to the game, increasing its complexity and appeal. Players now had to not only consider their moves on the board, but also the right time to double the stakes, adding a thrilling element of risk and reward. From tabula to tables, the game of backgammon has certainly come a long way. Through the ages, it has adapted and evolved, traveling across empires and cultures, capturing the imagination of countless generations. And yet, at its heart, it remains a simple, engaging game of strategy. A testament to its timeless appeal and enduring legacy. In the present day, backgammon holds its place as a beloved game worldwide. With the passing of centuries, the game has evolved, yet it has never lost its charm or its challenge. It has seeped into the fabric of societies, transcending borders and cultures, and has even found a home in the digital world. The formation of the World Backgammon Club is a testament to this enduring popularity. This global community brings together players and enthusiasts, fostering a shared love for the game. The club organizes international tournaments, where players from across the globe compete, their strategies and skills put to the ultimate test. And let's not forget about online backgammon. The advent of the internet has given the game a new platform, allowing people to engage in friendly matches or fierce competitions from the comfort of their own homes. It's a modern twist to an age-old game. So next time you roll the dice, remember, you're partaking in a game that's been enjoyed for over five millennia. The history of backgammon is a testament to its timeless appeal. Originating from the cradle of civilization Mesopotamia, this game has survived 5,000 years, weaving through the tapestry of time. Its journey is a captivating tale of resilience and adaptation, reflecting the very essence of human spirit. 
Today, backgammon still holds its ground, captivating minds with its strategic depth. Whether you're a seasoned player or a curious beginner, backgammon offers a rich history to match its strategic depth. Thanks for joining us on this journey through time.